Hi everyone, Succulents Box here. Since it's summer now, we've decided to share with you today a few things you need to consider to properly take care of your succulent and not kill them during this season. Unlike most houseplants, succulents love dry, warm climate. They don't need much watering at all as they have leaves that can store water, which helps them survive a long period of drought. A good rule of thumb to follow is to water your outdoor or indoor succulents thoroughly once every 10 days to promote healthy root growth, which should result in healthier plants, and at least once a week for indoor succulents. How often succulents planted in black plastic pots should be watered. On the other hand, depends on how fast the soil dries out. Either they are kept indoors or outdoors. The reason behind this is because the black color of the pot increases heat around the plants. And keep in mind that the higher the temperature is, the quicker the moisture will evaporate, and therefore the more you'll need to water them. So keep your succulents in black plastic pots hydrated. Regularly check the soil by sticking a finger at least an inch down into it. If the soil feels dry, then it's time for a good soak of water. On top of that, watering your succulents in the afternoon during the summer is not recommended. Instead, water them early in the morning before the temperature rises to avoid any hot water sitting in the crown of the plant. During the hot summer months, you can grow your succulents outdoors, but will need protection as the heat and sunlight this season can definitely cause sunburn, especially when exposed to long periods of time. With that in mind, expose your succulents to morning sunlight to keep them happy, then transfer them to a partially or fully shaded location in the afternoon, like under an awning or a place with dappled shade from a tree. This should prevent your plant from getting any damage due to intense heat and sun exposure, like a sudden change of color or bleaching. In case your succulent starts to become etylated or stretched out, it's a sign of a lack of sunlight. So better move it to a sunnier place where they get enough sunlight. When it comes to pests, the most common ones you need to watch out for during the summer are mites and mealybugs. Rodents and birds can also be a nuisance as they find succulents a good source of water, especially in dry periods and as well as snails as they love to crawl and munch on their thick leaves. You can, however, prevent the mites and mealybugs from infesting your succulents by applying repellents and exclusion and putting nets around them to stop rodents and birds from eating them. In case these mites or mealybugs are starting to appear in the base of your plant or even under the pot rim, you can hose them off or kill them with insecticidal soap. Also, make sure to check the roots too as it's their favorite place to live in. Aside from all the tips mentioned earlier, you need to keep as well as the area around your succulents free of buildup leaf debris, mulch, and anything that can hold water, as these can lead to root rot or even attract pests. Also, you should keep in mind that caring for your succulent still depends on their size and type, so it's still best to check their actual care guide, especially when it comes to watering. Furthermore, it's important to check as well the condition of your plants regularly. This should allow you to catch early signs of problems and prevent damage. And that's it for today. Hope you found these tips helpful in growing a happy and healthy succulent, even on the hottest summer days. We'll see you again next time. For more, you can find us at succulentsbox.com or on YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest.